please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. It helps. It really does. Hello, Fool Lovers. It's good you're here. Philip Kwok, also known as Kochi, was born on October 21, 1951, in Taipei, Taiwan. He is an actor, stuntman, and fight choreographer, best known for his work as the Lizard No. 4 from the movie The Five Deadly Venoms. He was a member of the famous Venom Mob, an ensemble of highly skilled martial arts actors that starred in numerous classic films for Shaw Brothers Studios in the 1970s and early 80s. He was also featured in the movies Ricky O, The Story of Ricky, 1991, Hard Boiled, 1992, and Tomorrow Never Dies, 1997. Philip Park began his career as a circus acrobat and worked in the Peking Opera. He never trained in any real martial arts. His skills were developed through the Peking Opera and his circus training. He was once quoted as saying, I have only ever learned real martial arts on the movie sets of people like Yu Chai Liang and Liang Ting. Peking Opera or Northern Style is the best basis for any martial art. I can pick up any style just by watching it for a few minutes. Unlike many others, he did not start off wanting to work in the movie industry. He began working as a stuntman in several films, and eventually, he was given big parts in the movies Dynamite Brothers and Match of the Great in 1974, The Master of the Flying Guillotine and The Fantastic Magic Baby in 1975. He was also given his first leading role that same year in the movie Marco Polo aka Four Assassins as Chong Fong alongside the legendary Alexander Fuchsia. Between 1975 and 1978, he would go on to star in nine other films with Alexander Fuchsia. In 1978, he was brought together with a group of Peking Opera trained performers. Together with the guidance from director Chang Che, they starred in the classic movie The Five Deadly Venoms. The success of this movie would go on to set many precedents for him and the rest of the cast. They would be, based upon the name of the movie, from that moment on what's come to be known as the Venom Mob, and Philip Buck would go on to be known as the Lizard Number 4. Going forward, he would often get cast as the leading man, even though he did not have what some seem to consider leading man looks. He did have a tough guy charisma. This, along with his wonderful exceptional acrobatic skills, he is easily in the top 5 greatest Kung Fu movies acrobat, would launch him into other short ventures as the main lead and the action choreographer. These films would include The Rebel Intruders, The Flag of Iron, The Sword Stain with Royal Blood, and Ode to Gallantry. In 1981, Philip Rock went back to Taiwan. There he founded a film company with his Taiwanese colleagues, Chiang Shen and Liu Feng. It is alleged at the time that they had a falling out with Chang Che and the other Venoms, Lo Man and Sun Chi. Some sources say this is not the case. What seems to substantiate this rumor is the movie Ninja in the Deadly Trap, in which they all starred, directed, and did the fight choreography for, was very similarly themed to the film which Chang Che himself was at the time filming for the remaining Venoms, namely the Chinese Super Ninja. As the Kung Fu genre became less popular in the 1980s, like so many Kung Fu actors, Philip Kwok's career eventually slowed down as well. During this period, he worked in the television industry as both an actor and action choreographer. By the time the 90s came along, he was a sought-after fight choreographer and would go on to work on such movies as The Peacock King, Hard Boiled, A Chinese Ghost Story, and The Touch. These were just a few of the films for which he was the action director. Up to the year 2022, Philip Pop was still active in directing and choreographing movies. He seems to be showing no signs of slowing down. With an impressive body of work both in front and behind the camera, it is a guarantee that Philip Pop's legacy in Kung Fu cinema is safe and secured. So to Philip Pop we say, thanks for the memories. If you have enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And feel free to leave a comment. Thank you and may the food be with you.